Hello and welcome to our virtual tour of our 2019 Hyundai Kona Elite. A little bit about us here at Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Canso. We're seeing at one of two of our pre-owned vehicle yards. We've got close to 200 vehicles in stock and go through about 180 on any given month. That is making us one of the largest pre-owned vehicle departments here in Queensland. As you can see though, quite a variety of vehicles at our main yard just near DFO. A showroom over the back where we've actually photographed each and every vehicle as they come onto the yard. Across the road though, we've got parts and services with the brand new part of Toyota and Lexus there. And as you make your way towards the city, you'll actually come across a second pre-owned vehicle yard as well. But throughout the video, I'll be going around the Kona here in complete detail, just pointing out any blemishes that may appear at first point of sale. So what we'll do is start down around the front here. Being the Elite, you've got the nice big alloy wheels. Just making sure there's no scratching or gutter rash. They're nice and tidy. You've got plenty of depth in those tyres, so that is part of the roadworthy certificate, which is included in that driveway price here in Queensland. Down around the front though, nice and straight, just making sure there's no dents or damages, no stone chips or imperfections. It's supposed to be very clean and tidy, so we get a good look. Uh, you've got the fog lights there, again, the next year being the Elite. No markings or damages underneath. Yeah, obviously being that compact SUV, good bit of clearance there. Across the bonnet, seeing if there's any dings, dents, or damages. One little stone chip just there. Apart from that, she's in excellent condition. So I do like to be completely transparent, point out things like that one little stone chip. Uh, at the end of the day, it is a pre owned vehicle, so it's to be expected, but we'll find them as we go. Down that passenger side, nice straight body there. Just checking that passenger front for you, no damages or imperfections again. Plenty of depth in that tyre as well. So we make our way down, you've got your indicators on the side mirrors. And one of the safety features, got blind spot indicators in it, built in the mirrors there as well. We'll see the buttons for these safety features later on in the video. And you've got your keyless entry just here. And as we're going down, just seeing uh, Dirt on that one there. Just keep an eye out for any dents, damages, stone chips. Looks to be in immaculate condition down that passenger side. Gonna fall down the passenger rear. Again, no gutter rash or scratching. Plenty of depth in that tire as well. So good to see that consistency as we make our way around the vehicle. Around the back end. A little marking just there on the plastic. Like I said, I'd like to be completely transparent. Uh, you do have your proximity sensors around the rear, built-in reverse camera that we'll see in action later on as well. Nice clean straight back end here. Marking just there. Second stone chip on the vehicle so far. While we're back here we'll have a look through the boot. Just make sure the plastics and carpets are in good condition. Parcel shelf, nice and tidy, and has not started to split through the middle, which is common in some of them. Have a look underneath, so you've got a bit of a false flooring in here. Before you've got your jack, your tools, and your spare down there. Beautiful. Nice level through the back there as well. Uh, that way, no troubles getting things in and out. Now as we make our way down the driver's side, again just try to give you a good angle. We'll cover each panel as we keep going. Uh, fourth and final wheel. Again, no damages or gutter rash and plenty of depth in that tyre. So all four wheels in the exact same condition. A couple of markings just down here. Now they are on the plastic so they're not really something that uh, gets brush touched sort of on the vehicle. Like I said, we do like to be completely transparent. As we make our way down that driver's side, nice and tidy again, no damages or imperfections. Give you that reverse angle, we can see there's no dings or dents. Windscreen, no major chips or cracks, again that is part of the roadworthy. So your built in uh, camera and radar there for your safety features that will go over shortly. The roof, no dings, dents or hail damage. Nice, straight and tidy. Beautiful. So the exterior is in immaculate condition. 
Uh, but we'll make sure the interior is the same. Start with the door cuts. Just make sure there's no wear and tear, scratching, scuffing. Nice and tidy. Uh, the footwells, no damages to the carpets or to the back of the seats. Yeah, going to be in the Elite, you've got the leather interior. Nice and tidy. No cuts, tears, burns or damages. And on the roof, no damages or imperfections or starting to sag, which is great to see. Driver's door, so obviously the most frequently used. So if we are to see wear and tear, it is likely to be on this one here. So we'll have a good look over. No marking, scratches or imperfections. Driver's footwell, no holes worn through and the driver's seat still in excellent condition as well. Beautiful. We'll jump in and start it up for you though. Two sets of fob keys, push button start on the left hand side. On the driver's door, electric windows, central locking for your side mirrors. Now you've got electric folding side mirrors as well. Nice and practical in those car parks. Uh, and then your safety features on the right hand side here. So your blind spot indicators, your lane departure, your traction control all just there. Cruise control with adaptive cruise on the right hand side of the steering wheel. And the left hand side all to do with your Bluetooth hands for in the head unit once the phone's connected. Um, but as we have a look up here, 21,690 kilometers. And uh, obviously we'll check that authenticity shortly with the service history. But you can have a bit of a flick through and set this one up as you please. Uh, the digital speedo seems to be a popular choice. Um, nice large touchscreen display up here. As you can see we've got the built-in uh, satellite navigation there as well. Uh, obviously making sure both sides of the screen are working there, beautiful. Uh, it's also where that nice large reverse camera shows up. Great vision out the back and it's right on that rear bar. You know exactly where the back of your car is. And as you make your way down, uh, you've got your air conditioning controls. And then all your connections like your USB, AUX, uh, second USB, 12 volt, all down there, tucked away neatly. But like most nowadays, in the automatic, but up front here on the passenger side as well, in excellent condition, just like the rest of the vehicle's been. No damages or imperfections. No fading, cracking or stickiness across the dash, which is great to see. All your books in here, we'll have a bit of a flick through the service history, the main one people want to know about. Wouldn't expect a whole lot of services, having only done 21,000 Ks. Uh, it's always good to double check, it's up to date. So, uh, it's done there at 2,600, it's initial check, and then serviced again at 16,000 there. Uh, so next one's not due till 30,000, so good bit of time for the next service, but all fully up to date. Last but not least though, I'll jump out, we'll have a look underneath the bonnet while the engine's still running for you. through the engine bay just making sure there's no rust or red dust not like you'd expect it on a vehicle like this but also we listen to that engine just ticking away nicely no major knocks rattles or squeals beautiful now that was our virtual tour of our 2019 hyundai kona elite i hope you enjoyed and i look forward to hearing from you soon thank you